I get no greater thrill than to be able to describe what it is that we do at Jev's Human Services. I think of Jev's being an organization that helps people to become self-sufficient and improve their quality of life. And our role is to help them navigate through that process. They teach you how to be self-independent again, how to live on your own. They give you a chance to feel like you're somebody. We were founded in 1941. At that time, we were referred to as the Jewish Employment and Vocational Service. Our role was to assist Jewish refugees to adapt to life in Philadelphia. From the very beginning, when we came over, we started English classes. So it was uh, organized by Jeffs. Jeffs, I believe, um, um, fits into that very small group of exceptional agencies. Agencies that go beyond just the basics of their contract. An agency that always sees the individual as opposed to just the dollars that individual can bring into the agency. Yeah, I, I guess the key word is, is making yourself feel appreciated when, when people thank you for, for the things you did for them. I'm folding the um, papers and putting them in the envelope, and Natasha's putting them in the envelope. It will be good experience for me, to, like on my resume for when I get a job. Jeff's is one of the premier organizations serving the Jewish community and the Federation finds that we have a great partnership with them and our investment in jobs provides a significant return on the investment. Being unemployed for a stretch there, things got very, very tight. Um, my benefits ran out and uh, money was tight and I ran out of resources and uh, they're, they're the ones that got me through uh, a difficult situation and I said, just make yourself better, you know. Take this and make yourself better. Make yourself a home. I probably would not have made changes at that time. Being in addiction is um, it's a bad, bad part of my life. And um, now recovery through Jeb's is it's great now. Without you, I wouldn't be living my life. And I was pretty sick when you came into my life. And it's been the faithfulness of my case managers and, and of Jeb's and my attendants that have gotten me out of this house and back into the work world full force. How about when you come to my room and have your nails done? Do you like having that done? Yeah. And what colors would you like on your nails? Red. Red to match your outfit today. Yeah. The most surprising thing about my experience at Jeb's is that it is more than the sum of its parts. That there's something magical about Jeff's. Jeff's is magic because of the people that work there. Uh, it's their commitment, it's their um, desire to help other people. That's what makes us Jeff's. It really goes beyond just helping someone find a job. They're having an impact on someone's life. Jeff's is uh, it's more about just helping um, the disabled. It's about um, you know, educating each individual so um, they don't feel like they're left in the dark. It makes my 30-some plus years very worthwhile to see somebody succeed in the way that Ben has done and to come back to say, thank you, Mr. Grant, is there anything I can do to help you? I decided that I just didn't want to sit home and collect the check because I knew I had um, skills and that's when I enrolled in their employment services program. I went from working in a hoagie shop to installing heaters and making better money. I recruit technical employees for SEPTA. It's challenging to find institutions that have a curriculum that would uh, benefit the people to pass the test here at SEPTA. Everybody wins with this. That's the great thing about it. When a client calls and tells me they got a job and because of what I told them and my sense of humor, they got the job and they never thought they would be able to land a position. That really makes my year. When I went to school, I didn't have no knowledge of HVAC at all. You know, whatever I learned over there, you know, it, you know, it gave me the basic information that I needed. I work for inmates. Um, I'm a job readiness teacher. I give them a little bit of life skills. You help them to find their way 
and what their likes and dislikes are, and what they want to do when they're out of prison. My internship allowed me to use my creativity and interest in radio and music to learn about the Jewish culture and serve the community. Uh, independence means uh, I do my own shopping, pay my own bills, do my own cooking, <laughs> cleaning. That's being more independent. I feel like 100% now. I mean, I honestly feel like, like I've got somewhere to go when I'm feeling to the point where I can't do nothing. And Jez has done that. So. When I see our consumers and our clients, it just brings life to the work that we do. Because in the end, it's all about the individuals we serve. It's not about us. We're proud of our rich history. We will be here today and into the future making hope happen. Mm -hmm.